WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. Here the Dow Industrials finished up 189, NASDAQ up 168, S&P's up 44. Gold, gold contract down $13.70, traded at 2,335 an ounce. We have silver down uh, up, rather, $0.07, cents, $29.54 an ounce. Copper, off two and a half pennies at 444 a pound. Light sweet crude, up two bucks, $80.47 a barrel. Notes and bonds, a 10-year note, down 14 ticks, 110.13. The 30-year off 27 at 119.19 and King Dollar. King Dollar down 206 ticks, trading to 105.344. Euro, 107, yen, 157, British pound, 127 to one U.S. dollar. We get over, let me, I'm just going to go to the DAX for a second first, folks, and because what you have out here, DAX, now, those didn't get smoked out here today, uh, DAX, index. That being said, though, I want to see how this thing bounced, because Europe is in bad shape, man. Yeah, okay, so I'll get the volume tomorrow, but here, let's, I want to see this volume from Friday. Yeah, it's huge volume, Okay. So it's not going to have it. So that's coming into the swing. Heavy volume. It bounced today with no volume. There's no action there. The cat, which is a different ball game for sure, because that's going to be that snap election. That's on the 30th, too. So this is going to get, okay, so this is the same thing. This is going to be a high volume low, I believe. 68 up today. Now, the reason we're doing this, yeah, it is. It's a monster. So that's a high volume low. So the cat's going to basically test that area. Now, let's go back to our S&P. So, we take a look at the S&P at the end of the day. And this is, this is still strong, man. 48 million shares. It's not bad. I took out the swing that had 63 million. We go to the Qs. And what does happen a lot here, folks, is this. This is going to get interesting. Yeah, see, the Qs, Qs are strong. That's 34 million. That didn't give up hardly anything. And what does happen, what is cool here... What does happen, I've seen corrections, folks, in the roll. So what ends up happening is that we get the roll going on this week, and this is where it can actually happen because there's so much action in the futures market and the S&P in the roll. So we'll see where it shakes out. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Come back and visit Tommy and Jacob tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. Great show, folks.